Hi, this is Brittany with the San Angelo Stock Show and Rodeo Association, the Livestock Director here. Uh, today I am going to work with you on your online entries and show you how to do that if you have any questions. To access the online entry site, you can do it one of two ways. You can either go to our website, sanangelorodeo.com, scroll over events, click livestock exhibitor information, scroll down, and then you will find uh, online entry site. You can click there to go to it or in your web browser you can just enter https colon slash slash angelo dot fairmanager dot com. So what we're going to do to start is we are going to go to log in log off. Uh, you should be selecting a club to enter. Um, that's the only way entries are accepted into our system so be sure you start here. Choose your club from the drop down menu. I, since I am using this example, I'm going to select Brittany. And the password for your club will be the zip code for your club. Then click log in. I, you will see this when you log in. Basically, if this is your first time into the system, what you are going to do is begin adding exhibitors and their entries. Um, what we do here is type in off of an entry form an exhibitor's first name and last name. Uh, this exhibitor say has not been here for before so I will click this exhibitor is a new exhibitor and click continue. Then it will be required for me to enter a password for the student, a mailing address, and I'm um, accounting in which they reside. This helps us track things uh, for marketing purposes. A phone number, date of birth, social security number, and a uh, quality counts number. And then you just click continue. Here you can review this information for accuracy. And then I, we're going to start making entries. So say per my entry form, I'm going to enter um, two market lambs. So I'm going to go to market shows. I'm going to select market lamb. And uh, it says here, special instructions or notes will be brought up as we do this. Uh, we're going to add this entry to cart and I had two of these so we're going to add a similar entry. I, it will automatically bring up the same exact one you just did and add that entry to cart. Now let's say I am also going to enter a guilt in the show so at this point I will uh, click add a different entry I can select the department, so we are going to select swine, CTBR guilt show, add entry to cart. Um, the heifers, the only difference here is that you are going to have to put in heifer information. So if I'm going to show an Angus heifer, I'm going to select the class that she falls in. Um, say her date of birth is 5114. Her name is... Uh, Brittany's beauty and her registration number uh, off of her actual registration paper. And then that's all I'm going to enter. Um, I'm quite the diverse, diverse exhibitor here. So at this point we can add an additional gate pass or parking pass if the exhibitor needs to enter one. Um, so I'm bringing my parents or my mom so I'm going to add an extra gate pass. Now, this is the important thing on processing fees. One has to be added per club, so I'm just going to go ahead and do it on my first exhibitor. Click continue, and then here are all of my entries. So that is how to do basic entries for an exhibitor. In the next webcast, I will show you how to add entries for a different exhibitor.